Hey guys, you might be wondering what this is, and you're gonna say, oh, it's a newt. Well, you know what? This isn't just any newt. This is a baby newt. See the little, little thingy sticking out of his head? Those are gills. He doesn't actually have lungs yet, so he's dependent on the water now, so that's why I put him in here. And soon, since he's looking pretty big now, he's going to lose those gills and crawl out as a, as kind of a land newt, more of a salamander thing. It's kind of orange. And then he's going to go back into the water, but with lungs as an eastern newt, fully adult. And you can see right now some key features of the baby is that he kind of has a big head, the obvious gills. Oh, chasing a little water beetle there. Um, and very stubby little legs. Soon his legs will get stronger. He'll lose those gills. He looks like almost ready to go on land now, actually. And he'll become a juvenile. And he's... Actually, there's some salamanders, believe it or not. This is a newt, I can tell, because we don't... Well, actually, we do have salamanders around here, but the salamanders are down further over there. <laughs> But anyway, this little guy, he's going to turn into a newt. Newts are pretty much full-time water. But salamanders, they, um, you know, they, um, they're mainly on land. And if you were to put them in a bucket of water like this, they'd actually drown because they don't know how to swim. And salamanders, they start off just like newts. But when they go on land, they're adults immediately. Yeah, believe it or not. But there's actually some salamanders... Not newts, actually, surprisingly, that stay like this for their whole lives. Their whole lives. Yeah, imagine that. They're called mud puppies and hellbenders. Okay, well, thank you for watching. And if you're interested in more, you can see my videos on adult newts and salamanders. And goodbye.